Boom. This is Wednesday, the 16th of May, 2018. I'm in Ocean Island Camping Park in County Wexford. I'm, I'm having a great time and this is my second video this morning. I just had, um, I just, as you saw me, I was in the kitchen preparing myself a pot of tea. So I'm just going to um, have my pot of tea here this morning and uh, we'll have a little chat and then I'm going to watch my videos of the, mo the mobile that we've done so far and um, then we'll make some more videos later on. So at the moment my fiancé is still in bed, fast asleep and it is now um, after 8 o'clock early in the morning so I'm not too sure exactly what time it is. Hold on, let's see now because my, my, um, hold on, look at my phone. I think this is my phone, yeah exactly it is my phone. So it is now nearly quarter to, quarter to nine in the morning. So it is now, it's now in, yeah, nearly quarter to nine in the morning. So it is quite early. So <clears throat> nearly quarter to nine in the morning and Liam's still in bed, fast asleep in a coma. So we won't be up till nearly half 11 or something. And so I needed his help this morning to help me with the fire and my video because I'm not an expert when it comes to memory boxes and and I would call technology and stuff like that and so and gas fires and because I couldn't trust myself with those sort of things so I need to his help this morning to to uh, set that up for me so I just made my pot of, set my pot, just made myself a pot of tea now and I'm going to get my, have myself a nice pot a nice hot cup of tea and they get myself all heated up because it is quite cold this morning so I'm going to I'm going to have a nice cup of tea and watch my videos and wait till Liam gets up and um, then we'll have um, Joel will um, Liam and I will try and see what plans we have for today he hasn't heard anything more about his car so we don't know what's going on with his car yet his car hasn't, he hasn't heard anything more from the, the people about his car he had trouble with his car on um, what day was it, we had um, a riding lesson on um, I think it was um, um, <clears throat> I think it was the day after we arrived, the 9th I think it was of May, I had a riding lesson up in um, Oak, um, Oak, um, Oak, um, I can't remember the name of the place, um, we had a, a riding lesson, whatever it was called, and we are on our way, on our way and the car broke down, um, Oak Park I think it was called, Old Park, whatever it's called. And um, it was a riding, riding, riding staples, and it was about half an hour drive. And his car broke down on the way. He was in trouble with his gears or something. His gears, he couldn't, um, he couldn't, um, he had trouble with his gears or something like that. So his car broke down. So we had to, so we had to get his car sent to a garage or something. So the guy who who owned the place kindly um, drove us to the um, riding school. We were late arriving because of his car. So we, so we were worried that we wouldn't be able to continue on with the writing lesson. So luckily we were able to continue with the writing lesson. We were slightly late, but he let, kindly let us um, get our writing lesson. And then he, he, he gave us a lift to the place. And then I had a writing lesson. And then he kindly left, dropped us home. But we had to pay 30 euro f to, to get a lift home. And, and he dropped um, our car down to the writing school. And then we got our car towed to um, a garage, I think. And our garage is now we, the, our car is getting repaired, but the, by a mechanic at the moment. And Liam hasn't heard anything more about his car, so, and it's going to cost a lot of money. Apparently, it's going to cost five hundred, or some five hundred. I can't remember. It's expensive anyway. Five hundred, a uh, five thousand, or something around that mark anyway. So, um, five hundred thousand. Something around that number. I can't remember exactly the type, the price, but it's a big sum of money. So um, hopefully we'll hear something soon. And um, um, so uh, we might 
my hair from either to and today or tomorrow. So so you won't be able to go anywhere until his car is until he has his car back. So um hopefully now he'll hear something soon because I'm I want to go back riding less back to riding as soon because I don't want to be stuck here for another day or for over too long because I want to I want to do something and maybe go riding or go shopping or something like that because I'd be bored stiff stuck here. So but anyway. But um, he should hear something hopefully from today or tomorrow um, from the uh, uh, from the mechanics. So please God we'll hear something soon and hopefully it'll be good news. And hopefully we'll be able to... Um, um, he was afraid that he he's hoping that he won't have to get a new car. And um, it's um, it's 2004, that's the year, that's the year um, the car is, it's, that's, how, that's how old it is, 2004, it's, um, it's 14 years old. So, um, so hopefully you won't have to. Hopefully you won't have to get a new car. Please God. Fingers crossed. But anyway, maybe we have to get to still it and do our normal routines and stuff and that get around. But anyway, um, speaking of speaking of the stud, I really miss all my friends and I've been home hoping to get to a gift shop and go go to a souvenir shop during the time during my time here so I can bring something nice for my friends that back at the stud and bring them a nice present back to them and hope they are okay and hoping them all my horse friends are fine like my friend Gail Force and War Tad and I miss them all over there and hope things are okay. I can imagine how busy it is at this time of the year. I say it's very very busy at this time of year, May, June, July, the mating season. They say it'd be a very very busy, very hectic time of the year, you know, it's a very very busy time of the year and you know the summertime is always very busy. So um, I can imagine well, a lot of tours will be on at this time of year too, a lot of tours. So in a way I'm kind of glad I'm not around when the tours are on, but I will miss my, all of my friends, I miss all my horse friends. So, but I'd be glad to get back to see my friends and I miss them all and that. So um, so I'll bring them back, I'm hoping to bring them back some nice present. So, um, that's all for, t for now, but I'll talk to you later on with the video diary and maybe I'll show him some more vid and some more mobile footage and hopefully now to get the place tidied up today and uh, give you another tour, give you a proper tour when the place is a little bit more tidied up. Thank you folks.